If you're looking for an easy and efficient way to clean your above ground pool, the Iper Scuba E1 might be the perfect solution. We were impressed by its large coverage area, powerful cleaning action, and superb filtration system. One of our favorite features is its lightweight design, making it easy to lift in and out of the pool, and it even returns to the edge automatically when it's finished cleaning. This robot also has a safety bumper, which is great for preventing any damage to your above ground pool liner. We found the Iper Scuba E1 extremely simple to set up and use. Like other Iper models, such as the Iper Scuba S1, it comes ready to go out of the box, although you'll need to give it an initial 4-hour charge before use. Once charged, we dropped it into our 12x 24-foot steel frame vinyl pool, and it immediately sank to the bottom and started cleaning. While it doesn't have the smart route planning of pricier options like the Iper Scuba S1 Pro, its randomized cleaning path proved highly effective. It picked up all visible debris, and we were surprised to find even smaller debris in the filter basket that we couldn't see from above. Emptying and maintaining the Iper Scuba E1 is a breeze. The filter basket lifts out conveniently from the top of the cleaner, and the ultra-fine filter cartridge is also easily accessible. The controls are very user-friendly. We didn't even need to refer to the manual. However, the manual does provide clear instructions and includes a QR code for a series of videos, although we found these less helpful. Overall, we highly recommend the Iper Scuba E1 for above-ground pools of various shapes and sizes. It's also suitable for in-ground pools without angled floors. Keep in mind that it's not designed for inclines or stairs, but it will effortlessly clean flat surfaces. So, if you're looking for a reliable and efficient pool cleaning robot, the Iper Scuba E1 could be your best friend this summer. Check out the video description for updated price. And thank you for watching this video.